ready? Okay. Team Winchester. <laughs> Earn your money, whore! <laughs> Dean Winchester eased the Impala up to 80 miles per hour. It was a knockout of a day, sunny and perfect, like a vintage ad for America the Beautiful. Sky so blue it hurt, the Red Rock Canyons in Sedona, Arizona had given way to windswept dunes as they headed west toward the California border. He had a belly, foot of, belly full of good greasy burgers from a mom-and-pop roadside stand a few miles back. Iron Maidens running free pumped through the speakers. His brother Sam rode shotgun, long legs bent at what had to be an uncomfortable angle, and balancing his laptop on his knees, a scattering of clippings and photos spilled across his seat. The road seemed to stretch out forever. If Dean squinted, he could almost pretend things were the way they used to be, the way they were supposed to be. <laughs> then the song ended, and a new one came on, when Dean heard the opening riff of ACDC's Hell Ain't a Bad Place to Be. He reached out and switched the music off. I think that's because he went to hell. <laughs> Sam didn't it's seem to notice or care that the music had stopped. He was utterly absorbed in whatever he was reading. Got something, Dean asked? Maybe, Sam replied. Minutes and miles rolled by in silence, broken only by a shuffle of pages and the clicks of keystrokes. S Dean could feel the cumulative weight of everything he'd been trying to forget crouching between them like a solid living thing. <laughs> the elephant in the room. So much left unsaid, so much that had already been said and could never be taken back. So, Dean finally said, you gonna share with the rest of the class? Border Patrol intercepted a truck full of illegals just south of... <laughs> <laughs> Sam responded, a routine stop. Only something went wrong and the officers involved never reported back to the station. <gasps> when they sent a backup unit out to the last known location, they found 15 mutilated corpses, including the three officers. COD is listed as wild animal attack. 15 corpses? <laughs> At least three of their southern bells now. <laughs> At least three of which were heavily armed and probably wearing body armor. That's some animal. Our kind of animal, Sam said, clicking through another page. Truck door was busted open from the inside. Says here there's been some speculation that the smugglers involved may have been trying to import some type of large exotic mammal, like a tiger or a bear. Great, Dean rolled his eyes. Not another damn werewolf. Oh Sam God. shook his head. It gets weirder. Does this end? Doesn't it always? No. <laughs> Sam showed one of the photos to Dean, who glanced sideways to look at it. Can a werewolf do something like this? <laughs> Sam said. The photo showed an official Customs and Border Protection SUV. Well, half of an SUV. <gasps> a little less than half, to be precise. The front half was perfectly normal, undamaged. The back half had been removed with surgical precision. Metal and plastic melted, shiny, smooth along. And they think edges. an animal did this? <laughs> and if someone had drawn a slightly curved line in the sand, and everything on one side of the line had simply vanished, while the rest of the animal, while the rest remained untouched, I mean. <laughs> On the ground nearby was a uniformed body of a CBP officer. His Kevlar vest was torn to rags. So was he. And he didn't have a head. Ah! <laughs> Were werewolves are stronger than any normal predator, but their claws can't go through Kevlar like that, Sam tapped photo. <laughs> and what the hell happened to the SUV? It looks almost like some kind of large protective circle had been drawn and then everything inside the circle disappeared. Transported maybe, but where? Yeah. Oh, Sam, someone say that. That's where I would go. <laughs> Sam glanced over at his kid brother. Sam was staring intent now. Dean and Sam, whatever. I don't know the difference. <laughs> He'd got the scent of something new and was intrigued. It was the closest thing to human emotion that Dean had seen in his brother face when Sam had been brought back from hell. I knew he went to hell. Maybe this was just what they needed. Something to take their minds off the big picture. <laughs> Dean could feel old, familiar excitement building inside him. The thrill of the hunt. He looked away toward the jaw-ragged mountains. Was he kidding himself to think they could forget the past and the weight of the potentially bleak and hopeless future and lose themselves in an interesting job? Maybe so, but that wasn't going to stop him from trying. <laughs> he needed a distraction too badly. Where the hell is Chulik anyways, Dean asked, turning to Sam. The corner of Sam's mouth twitched just a little. Dean chose to interpret that as a smile.